So the first Fi Stick we have here is going to be from Mac Cat's Fi Stick Pro, and this one is the Xbox 360 version. This one is the older models, but as you can see, no screws on the top and no button to open it. We just have the buttons, the joystick, and the sticker. So what we need to do is flip over our Fi Stick. So now once we flip over our Fi Stick, we have a couple of screws right here, the four rubber feet and two in the middle, but I think there's two more that are covering the rubber feet. So all you really need is just a simple Phillips head screwdriver, at least a zero and a one. Right now we're going to use a one bit right now to unscrew the four rubber feet right here. So let me just show you. Real simple. There you go. Just unscrew it. And then you could take out the whole entire screw and the rubber feet. It's a pretty long screw for all, all of these legs as you can see here. There we go. And as you can see there's another screw over here in the bottom and I'm going to unscrew the rest over here for the rubber feet. So now we took out all the four bits right there for the rubber feet and now there's six more that we have to unscrew and I recommend going with a zero or lower so that you do not damage the threads on top of the screw itself because these screws are very small so let me just start off with the top one right here and remember this is a zero bit screwdriver fill hits and there we go we got it and let me just give you a close up yeah it's like pretty small like really really small. Let me try another one. Just gotta go right here in the bottom. Again this is a zero. Pretty simple. And then we take it off and there you go. And now I'm gonna unscrew the rest of them. So there we go guys, we unscrew all, I guess I could say, 10 of the screws. So all we need to do is just flip it a little bit on the side. Let the panel come off. There you go. Just put this on my lap. And there you go. You got the access to your buttons and joystick right there. And you can do whatever you want. And that's how you open the Mac Hats Fi Stick Pro. So the next Fi Stick is going to be the Mac Hats TS Plus Shallow Edition. And of course I already modified it to a Karen stick. But what you need to open the top screws over here is going to be a T15 head. So I'm just giving you a close up right here. The T15, T-O-R-X uh, bit. That's what you really need. Now of course I do not know if they sell them as an individual screwdriver. So you mostly have to find these in a set. But either way, that's what you need. And all you need to do is just place it in this real nicely and counterclockwise to unscrew and there you go that's how you remove the screw for the TS plus so again let's do it one more time and there we go real easy so let me do the rest for all of them So now we have all the screws unscrewed and all you need to do is lift up your joystick and just be careful with this little plastic gray that kind of goes around the fly stick and just flip it over and there you go. You have access to your buttons, the wires and the joystick. But that's how you open the Mac Cats TS Plus. So the next stick we have here is the Hobby Rav 4 which I already have modified myself because there's already six screws right here on the top of the plate. But of course to do that you need to remove the whole entire sticker. But of course the way to open it is to turn it around. So 
So now as we turn it from the bottom right here guys, as you can see there's a total of 7 screws, but there's this warranty sticker, and it's mostly going to be right here on the top, but if you do remove it, you void the warranty. So if you still have a brand new 5 stick that is not working, then just return it and get a new one. But other than that, you know, you just want to get in and do whatever you want to, then this sticker is pointless. But either way, all you really need is to have a normal Phillips head screwdriver. That's all you really need. So we're going to start off with the bottom right here just to show you. This is a number one. You could go with a zero if you want to, but I'm going with a number one. And there we go. We took it out. And pretty simple. No more Phyllis heads. And we're going to do the rest to all of them. Okay everyone, so now once we remove all the screws, all you need to do is just lift up this little metal plate. And there you go, you have access to your buttons and joysticks, depending on which one you're doing, but that's pretty much it. That's how you open the Hobby Wrap 4. Now for the very final stick, it's going to be very easy. This is the Racer Panthera Marvel vs. Cancom Infinite for the PlayStation. And it's pretty simple, all you need to do is just hit this little tab and your access to your wires, the buttons, and the joystick. It's that pretty simple. So that is the end of the video guys. Thank you for watching and of course the final fight stick I have here which is recent. I have the Quamba Pearl Obsidian fight stick and I'm not gonna open it maybe in the future but for right now I just really love the design. You know just all white buttons, joystick. I mean it just looks so nice. I really love this look of the fight stick. But like I said, maybe in the very future I might open it, but for right now, I'm just going to leave it how it is. But that's pretty much it guys, make sure to share this video with anyone that wants to learn how to open the fight stick. And other than that, keep on playing, game for life guys, see you later.